Okay, Jay, we're going to spin one of these uh, nice tornado fries here. Now, we've got a skewer. We use a skewer for this machine that is a 3 16th inch or a 5 millimeter. That is the same. And we're going to put a pilot hole through this big potato with a number two screwdriver. It's the same size as that skewer. Costs about three bucks. If I made a tool, I'd have to charge probably 20. Okay, so now we made that pilot hole, and we're going to put that skewer right through there, maybe an inch, inch and a half. That's pretty good. Now she's going to go from the inside of the cutter and put the long skewer end right through there. And then we're going to go ahead and put the pointed end into the potato holder with the six prongs. Okay, now we're going to shove it forward so it's right and ready to go and we're going to spin some of this. It's going to be a little big potato for this uh, skewer, but we'll go ahead and spin it. Perfect! Okay, now she pulls that out of there and she'll pull the top slice up and onto that pointed end. That's going to hold it. And then we're going to fan this down. Just like so. That's a big potato, isn't it? Yeah. See how nice that's looking like a big Christmas tree. And you fry that right on the skewer also. You can do a bigger skewer if you've got a big fryer. But uh, they just walk around and uh, pick that off and eat it. Use a little seasoned salt on it. Big seller. Yeah, Lowry salt is, a, is really a good choice, but uh, you can do your own thing. Okay, thank you for watching.